Uh, this is uh, another Grayland Challenge, a special one here for us uh, tonight. Um, we got uh, we got the captain in the house. We're going to do a a rather unique uh, Grayland Challenge. I'm going to shoot off a laptop uh, screen to a car parked outside. And uh, Jason, uh, yep. our Aloha uh, new comrade joining us from uh, uh, the great state of Hawaii in, in the Grayland factory authorized rep uh, program with us. I'm going to have you take this one away. Okay. All right. Max, can you hear me okay? Yeah, I hear you perfect. Go ahead, Jason. All right. So why don't we get a couple of baseline I mean, readings off the vehicle and first uh, go and start it up for us. You want me to start it now? Yes, sir. Okay, it's on. All right, so while it's idling, why don't you just go back to the tailpipe and see how the smell is coming out of the exhaust pipe. Okay, I'll do that right now. All right, something weird happening here. Well, don't breathe it too much, uh, Max. Yeah, you ain't kidding me. And there's a lot of stuff happening here. <laughs> Hold on. Can you find the tailpipe? Stick your nose down in there. See how it I'm smells. smelling it. I'm I'm smelling it. I, I feel like it's change. It's changing the uh, the carburetor of my nitrogen is, is a lot less now. All right, go in and before we send you anything, go in and get a a reading on the RPMs. Rev it a couple times. Let it settle into idle, and tell us where the RPMs are. Wait a minute, I'm getting no carbon monoxide smell. It's gone. There's no carbon monoxide smell. It's gone. Okay. Go in and check the RPMs. This one works probably pretty fast. Okay, <laughs> okay hold on a second. I'm going to it. It's a 900 RPMs. Okay, give it a couple of revs up to about 2,500 RPMs. Okay, doing it now. All right, since this is a new method, Gary, can you just describe what you did and what that device was that was showing on the camera? Well, um, yeah, that. what we're doing is we're uh, – we're mixing up a, a frequency that's uh, coming off the screen of his uh, laptop and uh, shooting it across the living room through the window and into the toxins of the car. And uh, we're doing that from Boston down to uh, South, uh, South Carolina. Is it South or North Carolina? North Carolina, yeah. North, and, uh, North Carolina. And uh, that energy field then is uh, is coming all the way in uh, into that into that uh, into that spectrum uh, and releasing those toxins right off his screen through uh, you know through the power of the internet. Can you show that device one more time? Um, yeah, I had just one quick second. Tell you the car is running a lot smoother. Just a second, Max. We're going to get another reading on the RPMs. Let it idle a little bit longer. Okay. And then we'll go back to the tailpipe. And if you can notice a difference in the smell, and I want to see if you notice any moisture coming out of the tailpipe. Yeah. 
so what is what are the RPMs at now, Max? Are they still around 900, or have they dropped? No, no, they dropped. And they're, um, they're, oh my God, they're dropping. It's dropping down to 800, 800, almost 700. I've never right. seen it drop that far down. So that's through your computer monitor and direct line of your vehicle inside your house. How, how, how many feet would you estimate it's away from your, your vehicle's gas can, your uh, gas tank? Okay, I, I figure about 35 feet. Perfect. Go back and check the exhaust, see if you notice that it's, it, what is gonna happen is it's gonna turn into steam coming out of your tailpipe, it's gonna be zero emissions. You're going to run this tank. Yeah, you're going to finish this tank of fuel, and then you're going to need to repeat this process unless you're able to use the text message or an email on your phone. So if not, you have to repeat this process with your next tank. And then you're going to want to change okay. it. Uh, I, don't, I don't have a smartphone, so I can't do it. Hold on. Let me go check the... Uh the fumes, because before I could smell the gas, even before we did this test. And you ain't kidding, man. I'm back here now, and I don't smell nothing. You wear ma uh, glasses, don't you, Max? Stick your glasses down there and see if they haze up uh, and get any moisture on the lens. Well, I don't have the glasses. Uh, wait a minute. Hold on. The, the ones that you were wearing, if you have those, I can wear Put your hand down there. My God, the thing, it's not, the, the emissions are perfect, man. There's no smell of nothing. You see the liquid coming out? It, it's coming out real clean, and not only that, I don't smell the gas anymore. Nice. How, how, I how did exactly. Miles, you, describe how what? your vehicle and how many miles since we don't have a camera on it. This vehicle is a 2001 Lincoln Navigator with a 5.4 uh, engine injector, and it has a hundred. What am I? Hold on a second. I'll tell you how many miles in it. It's got 170, 178,000 miles. Nice. So, from a desktop monitor and direct line of sight out to your vehicle in your driveway, you're lowering your emissions to zero, ultimately. Now, with that high mileage, on, you're going to want to run two tanks of gas through there and then change your oil. And Very now, well. Great job! <laughs> you're going to see a big... Hey, by the way, in, in, in the RPMs are down to 700. RPMs are down to 700. Come on in and uh, let let us see a uh, look on your face after uh, this challenge. <laughs> Good job. Man. Okay, uh, go ahead. Go ahead and turn off the car. Turn it off. Come on in. Off the cam. Yeah, I'll turn, you, but you want me to turn off the car, right? Sure. Okay, I'm turning it off. Oh my God, incredible. You just broke through all the timelines in the dimension and all that. Incredible. Okay, I'm heading back in. So while he's walking in thunder, could you just explain to viewers how in the heck that just happened? Is this in, a, in uh, layman's terms? Yeah, it, it worked very well. Um, <laughs> I, I, Do you yeah. want me to hang up the phone? No, no, stay on the phone. Yeah. Until you get back to your computer. I'm going to have to turn my way. All right, now turn your phone off and turn the volume on your computer. Max, go ahead and hang. Yeah, there you go. You're muted. So what do you think, Max? Man, I swear to God, this is incredible. 
<laughs> hey. I'm, I'm looking forward uh, to being on your show here tomorrow evening, Max. Uh, yes, man. I, I'm so glad you're going to be on there. This is going to be a lot of fun. Uh, that'll be 10 o'clock Eastern Standard Time. Give out a uh, shout out to everybody where they can find the show. Yeah, Wolf, Wolf Spirit, uh, radio .com. We got I got to put the WW first. Wolf Spirit Radio. Com. I'll be sure to put, post that down in the uh, comment section here. 10, 10 p.m. Eastern. We're going to be running. Uh, we're going to be running the uh, Grayland Zone uh, video cam through the radio show, so it's going to be both a audio and video production here uh, that folks will be able to see. So, um, hey, thanks for stepping out, uh, taking the Grayland challenge, seeing uh, you know firsthand, uh, you know what this is all about. One of the coolest phenomenons that is sweeping the planet right now, and we're glad you're part of it. Yeah, I'm glad I'm part of it. Uh, you know, I wish I could uh, be like a salesperson for you guys to sell a lot of your products and get it going out there because I have a lot of, I mean, I have thousands and thousands and thousands of uh, people that uh, follow me. So I'm right. well, we'll, we'll make you a factory authorized rep. I have you here in Grayland University like uh, Jason's been spending here for the last – Hey, uh, Jason, tell everybody a little bit about, you know, yourself uh, since you've been uh, coming in to what we call Grayland University, getting your training, getting your understanding of the science and spending time here with the team. Uh, you know, just in, in, in 30 seconds, uh, how, how's it impacted or what have you seen? Yeah, it's, it's, it's really amazing that it, it showcases the, the power of, of, of advanced technology how it can work irregardless of your intention. And you know what, it, honestly, the way it's described on this forum makes it pretty easy to understand the basics of quantum mechanics. And from there, you just start to expand your capacity to, to understand the technology, at least at a user level. So I, I really appreciate it. I'm happy to be in here and uh, honored to be a part of, of, of this movement. It's a worldwide movement that is History in the making, you know, right here is getting underway, and it's uh, there's nothing that's going to be able to stop it because it's great for humanity. Wow, I, I'm wow. Thank you very much, Jason. Um, you. Uh, give folks a shout out at your uh, factory authorized website. Mine is uh, energyhologram.com. Energyhologram.com. Good job. And uh, energy holograms is what we do, powered by Grayland. Until next time, this is uh, Thunder at Grayland.com. Thanks for this awesome challenge, Captain Max. I look forward to seeing your show, uh, being on your show tomorrow. Jason, appreciate you. Yeah, honor. Thank you, Thank Ma. You. Aloha. Aloha. <laughs>